most common reported cases of adverse events following immunization or AFI among the pediatric population are dizziness, pain in the vaccination part of the body, fever, and increased blood pressure. According to National Immunization Technical Advisory Group or NITAG for COVID-19 Vaccine Pediatric Infectious Disease member, Dr. Mary Ann Bunyi, myocarditis or inflammation of the heart muscle is monitored and reported in other countries but it is a rare case. Dr. Bunyi also said myocarditis can't be caused by COVID-19 vaccines. In the 5 to 11 year old, very rare case of myocarditis was never reported in that study. Mas mataas ang pagkakaroon ng myocarditis kapag nagkaroon ka ng natural infection secondary to SARS-CoV-2 than mabakunahan ka ng COVID-19 vaccine at magkaroon ka ng myocarditis. The health expert also said adverse events is more common among the adult population compared to the pediatric population. Based on the Food and Drug Administration's report, there are only 3% among the 12 to 15 years old who experienced AFI. More than 6.2 million or 58% among them have been fully vaccinated, while 7.6 million or 71.21% already received their first dose. Dr. Buni also said, like the 12 to 17 years old, children aged 5 to 11 years old without comorbidities will be prioritized, but they still have to seek clearance from their doctors before their inoculation. Sa aking palagay, ganun din ang mangyayari dito sa uh, pag-roll out ng 5 to 11 years old. Uh, malaking bagay, mapapriorid din natin, yung mga matang may comorbidities at may listahan yan na katulad ng listahan na ginamit natin doon sa 12 to 17 years old. Nandun lahat yung mga underlying medical illnesses 5 to 11 years old children with comorbidities who can receive their COVID-19 shot include those with medical complexity, genetic conditions, neurologic conditions, cardiovascular disease, obesity, HIV infection, tuberculosis, chronic respiratory disease, and renal disorders. Dr. Buni also said that the COVID-19 vaccine dosage for 5 to 11 years old will have a different vial cap and has a lesser dosage compared to the dosage for 12 to 17 years old. Dose was one-third of the adult dose, which is 10 microgram given at 0.2 ml. The vial which is used for the 5 to 11 year old has an orange cap. It is also a multi-dose vial, which is good for endoses. The route of administering the vaccine is both intramuscular. Aiko Miguel, UNTV News and Rescue. We serve the people. We give glory to God.